Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome back to another day in Graveyard Keeper. So I do have to correct myself. I do apologize. I'm playing it. I'm playing it. So I did. I was incorrect on one of the uh, one of the uh, autopsy. So when you get the important part, so I make. I uh, remember. I told you that you get. Uh, randomized RNG on the red skulls or the white skulls and I do have to correct myself it is white skulls or red skulls or both so you can have either one of those three at yeah, randomized how much you can get white skulls for sure is maximum two now yes yes so I have never gotten a three yet maybe maybe we'll get some but maximum is two so far and the red one is maximum three so you can get from 0 to 3 or 0 to 2 on the white one so that is what I do apologize that I made a mistake on that I am learning myself and also the surgical mistakes I actually don't remember if it gives you a red skull or not but it does take up one room and you can't remove it uh, here's the goldfish I mentioned it's it's only 5% is that C2 I, I was lucky I was lucky all right so this one this one there golden crucian and I, I, I botched that, didn't I? I botched that. But yeah, so that is to get that. So in order to get that, you want anchovies, which is these small little fish that are in the sea. You can go ahead and fish for that. They use just the simple, simple fishing rod. And once you get that, you go to the river. You can fish, if you want to risk it, go ahead and fish at night at 9%. So I wish you luck. Or just wait until the morning and fish there. You get 16% and then... You get that. Once you get that, go to your table. Right here. Yeah, I was looking around me. I want all I'm on, I want a variety of them. So I went ahead and looked at and then you can see here. You can see it gives you different ones and then this is where I saw. And then when you chop it up, it'll give you gold. But this one looks more I want this one. I want, actually I want all the perks. But yeah. So I think I caught majority of the fish. There is still one more I um, it is a low one too, so I'm pretty sure it's another rare fish up there, but yeah. So that's the last fish I'm missing, but with that being said, that is the way I think we should get gold, and that's about it. And a tip for fishing, I lost so many fish because I kept staring at the bobber. I was like, wait, wait, why why am I losing all my bait? Because uh, when, when well, usually in game, when the bobber goes down, that's when you usually pull it up, right? And I did that, and I lost so many uh, baits and fish from that until I only seen this at the sea part, but when you're at the sea, your character is standing like this when he fishes, right? And then you want to look at the back because when he fishes the back, it kind of uh, leans in just for a, like a, a split second and leans back. When he does, when it does uh, lean in, pull the rod up and then you will definitely get a fish. That is the only place I've seen him uh, kind of lean in just a bit like jerking in and then jerk out. It's, it's there for a split second so you have to pay attention to that. Once you see that pull up and you should get a fish let's say 95% it will work so far for me it's 100% every time I did that it worked so look at the back when the back like when you when he fish the back does not move at all because when he faces this way uh, there's areas uh, I'd never seen the back move so yeah so that is the downside of that one okay okay body body yeah I've been waiting for that so when that happens I did notice something else because I, I, I just started staring at my guy me there has to be a cue on how we can um, get always get fish or else you're just gonna keep losing bait because uh, uh, some bait some fish require like different fishes or like insects as the bait and you don't want to lose those so I kept an eye on my guy and when he does this way look at his hands okay look at his hands you do like um an, a bobbing up and down hands but there is a split second where he does it really quickly twice quick twice quick and when he does that twice quick pull up and you should be able to get that fish it won't it won't work like the the back always but it will happen majority of the time that's how i kind of noticed that and that's how i've been fishing i need your help 
Uh, I need help with a merchant. He told me that you knew well. He used to buy love potions from you with his friend, the priest. Oh, I remember. They were so sweet, but they were brothers, I recall. Oh, so how can I help him? He ate some hiccup grass and lots of scent of taste. I think he's cursed. Sounds like a curse laid on him by another witch. So it would be unprofessional of him, of me, to help him. In old time, we used to help out situations like this, but then the whole market collapsed. Now it's forbidden. Only the witch who placed the curse on him can craft a potion to remove it. So there's no cure? Oh, Let me see. I told you the basic, and you're no witcher. There's a fancy word for what you are. Uh, a warlock? Oh, Chemist. Alchemist. Oh, right. So you can craft a potion from him. Uh, and I'll tell you the recipe. Just put salt and health solutions together. Thank you. I already have this. Alright, how much is that? Four for four. That's a good testing. Alright. So I went ahead and read more about the bombing. Okay, we used that there. Okay. So this one has a positive white. Gold injection are two whites. Silver injection is a white, but they both remove reds. And then this one is a negative negative. I don't know what's the point of negative negative. Oh. In case you want to add something else in, like a, maybe a, a double negative or a, a, a double positive or double positive red white depends. All right, so we have four and four here. So we're gonna go ahead and use the gold one. Oh, it takes forever. Oh. Okay, okay. And then we're gonna go ahead and use the silver, right? So we use this one already to preserve it. This one adds glue, so I'm going to go ahead and add that in after. Silver adds that. This one, negative, negative. All right, all right. Let's go ahead and craft that. And then it will be one for seven. Adding the glue will be one for eight. Removing the blood will remove that, but add a white, so that's a nine. Removing the fat, that's a ten. And then, I'm, like I mentioned before, I'm pretty sure there is a perk to see it, because we're getting perks everywhere pretty sure there's gonna be a perk to see which um which organs are the best right now right now i think these are my plus twos i don't know about red but they're plus two for whites these are plus one so i'm pretty sure we will find some and then i don't know what the max of uh, max you can get but so far no deaths i mean i like no no death I haven't died in the game either yet. Other than the one that uh, we went out of the town and then got burned by that fighter. That's the only one I got died in, but I think that's all. Alright, so uh, take a small break and we'll be back in like maybe a second. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, be back. Okay, so okay, so we have all oh, this one. Acid, negative, negative. That is, I know there's a purpose for that. Okay, and glue will give us one white, okay. But it takes so long. I might actually build two of these tables. Two of these tables and then more storage along down here and then make two tables. This, this takes forever. Alright, then one for eight. We're one for eight. Okay. So now I'm gonna go ahead and remove the blood. It's gonna be one zero for nine. Alright, and then if I remove the fat, it's going to be 0 for 9 still, or is it 0 for 10? Because fat is negative skull, red skull, plus a white skull. So I think we're still going to be 0 for 9. <gasps> Never? Okay, I don't know why uh, we need to put that lie injection in then for... Oh, no clue, no clue, but 10? 10? I'll take 10. Alright, this is the best body I have. All right, there you are, mister. Uh, here, here we go. Here's the acid. I think there should be more than enough. Task completed. Uh, I need your help. I need ink. I need ink and paper. Hmm, I have some. Actually, I have a lot of useful things. Some of them may be useful for beginner scientists such as yourself. I can't stand those chumps at the university. I'd rather earn a little extra coin elsewhere. Okay. Alrighty, everyone. Let's craft some human meat burgers. Man burgers or people burgers or yeah, I think it might be human burgers. All right, I got. I did not know it. it uh, I needed. I needed five, right? All right. So let me uh, and ten beers it said. All right. 
wait for these to finish and we can make the next one. So I've been wondering, since for the embalming we don't have the lie injection, I think it was, and then rest, re, rest oh. oh, there's one more. Okay, there's the restore restoration injection and then the dark injection, right? I'm pretty sure one of those or maybe all of them will give us somewhat like plus plus uh, red skulls or like plus white skulls and red skulls. So. I think I understand it now. So, what they want you to do with that is actually add it into the body so you can um, increase the number of white ones and red ones. When you do that, you use the other embalming and then the blood. Well, in the blood, I think the blood and the fat will be last, but the other embalmings will add white skulls in there and then remove the red skulls leaving you probably with uh, two or less and then that's the one that you use the fat and the blood cells or the blood to remove and you add on white skulls if, if you understand that a little bit like that that is what I'm thinking that's why we need the embalm so if that goes then I'm guessing blood and fat is going to be the end other than the in uh, the organs are going to be in, so the first stop are probably embalming it, trying to prep it up, remove some of the blood, and then you should be set. All right, we can do this. Oh, okay, okay. I'll make sure to um, go there. So um, I guess relax into this one because this one I'm gonna go ahead and talk to that lady, see how I can impress her. And then uh, we'll continue off from there. All right, everyone. Hello, it's you again. Oh, that's it. I I I have that from us. Okay. Let's see how it works. I think you owe me an apology. I'm not a small man. I'm a respected graveyard keeper. But I'm also a fan. You so you just call me keeper. Hmm, maybe there's something to you after all. The contract between your dirty job and your manner. Thank you. <laughs> nice to meet you, Keeper. You must compliment me not only my talent, but also my beauty. I'd like to hear something nice. Uh, uh, that's my snake. I met Snake at Church Cellar, but he's not very talkative. Maybe you can help me deal with him. Oh, I can't imagine what normal business someone could have with that sneaky. By the way, if you see him, please throw this fake coin in his face and tell come back here and tell me how he reacted. Oh, that's funny. I want I want to throw some uh, fake uh, fake coins. Okay, okay. So that is her mission. I think that's all for now. All right. So. Might as well make this um, a zombie. Let's see how fast it is. Efficiency it is. And then uh, we'll see. So the last one we made was a 6, right? I think it is. Efficient 25%? Oh, wow. 10, 20. So 20 will be 50%? Oh, wow. All right. All right. Let's see. Let's see, guys. This guy. 15. Okay. 15. 10 is 25. Alright, what's that guy? Oh, that's horrible. I'm gonna remove him. Alright, alright. So, depending on how to do, I might actually see, um, once I get the other embalming, I will see how, how much we can go for the max for that. So, I'm gonna play around and then see how I can do it because I'm pretty sure the steps are going to be different. I put everyone back so just a recap just in case you didn't understand what I was talking about the embalming and autopsy that I want to play around with it because before we did embalming we did pure autopsy which is um, removing the either the blood, the fat, the important organs and then you try to get white ones like that. Before I usually try to find or try to get the work on zombies or the, the dead the dead with um at least two red and four white the reason why is that because every time i grab a body the first thing i always do is remove the blood and remove the fat those two will remove two reds and add on two whites giving me six whites and zero reds when i finish if i have like um, an extra red like there's one more red I got removed that is when I usually play around with the organ usually starting with the intestines then the heart then the brain to see which one will remove the uh, red but keep the white sometimes they do one in one 
and I'm okay with that. I want it six one six minimum for the graveyard. But now that we got embalming, that step is going to be different because we want to. Looks like we want to add in some red, so we can remove the red because we have more injections or something to remove the red. So we should be fine with that because. So far, we used the glue injection, which gave us one. Because I remember we did that. We did that at the end. The preserve is nothing, but it just preserved from a decaying, which is good. The silver injection was removing one red, add one white. So that's something good right there. Gold injection removes two red and two white. So in total of that, we removed three reds and then three white when we include the glue that's three reds and two white oh three reds and four whites so now we just gotta keep pushing on the main story i think it is to until we get uh something with dark unless i just buy it but right now for me i want to see if i can craft it so i know what to hunt instead of relying on purchasing so I'm guessing, I'm guessing the dark one and what if the lie one, I think it is. Because we read the restore one, it's just a decay. So one of those two or both of them will be adding red skulls. So those steps are going to change depending on that. So right now, I think my steps, depending on what body I get, will usually be probably to preserve it so I can... Um, Depending on how big the, how much uh, red skulls we have, preserve it. And then I might uh, do the silver, the gold, and then the glue, and then autopsy, the blood, and then the fat, and then hopefully that removes all the red. If it doesn't, I'm going to have to play around with the intestine. So that is going to be my steps until I get, or until I know how to craft the death stuff. So I can include the lion, li, is it lie? Lee, lie, lie injection, and the other one is death injection. No, no, dark, dark injection. So those two, I will see what they do once we unlock them, because I don't think they tell us right here, right? So we go on bombing here. Oh no, it does, it does. <gasps> okay, dark adds two reds. Okay. Wait, wait, the whole time it told me I did not pay attention. Oh, it did. Oh my goodness. All right. So this one adds a red and a white. And then this one adds two red. So I don't know what the two reds do. But this one. Acid removes one to one. Okay, so this one I can add lie injection first. So that will give me additional red and white, but bonus one white. And then after that, I can... No, wait, 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 wait. Clear, clear, clear right there. Clear. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, okay. First, we do... When we grab a body, we do pre preserve embalming first. So we can uh, halt the decay for a bit. And then we add the lie injection that adds one red and one white. After that, I will probably use the silver injection that removes the red skull that we got from the lie injection, but then adds a white injection or white skull. We will add the gold one in, we'll remove additional two red skulls and give us a two additional white skulls. We go ahead and include the glue injection, which gives us one more white. And depending on how it ends, we might have three to two red skulls at the end, which I will use the blood autopsy and the fat autopsy to remove two red ones and add two white ones. Give or take, I might be able to get 12 white and maybe one red, depending on how it goes. So it's going to be a very interesting playing around and um, see what order we have to do it. So with that being said, let's go ahead and who is this one again? All right, here we go. Here, I bought this cure for you. Clotho told me it will help. <laughs> Let me try it. Just sprinkle on these fried grasshopper. <laughs> Delicious, even tastier than before. <laughs> Thank you so much. Where do you get this precious ingredient? I made it myself. All I took was some alchemy and a bit of common sense. <laughs> interesting, interesting. I see many possibilities here. <laughs> this fruit flavor can open many gates, even perhaps the palace gates. I will need a range of dinner for some 
of the royal council members, and that's where I need your help. I need to cook a great dinner for five people. Just make sure some snacks, a main course, and some dessert, but they should all be the highest quality. Why me? I'm no good at cooking stuff. I, I, I can trust no soul in the town. The stakes are too high. Why, why don't you cook it? Yeah, what are you doing here? Nonsense, I'm a foodie, not a cook. Don't worry, you can do this. And that spicy meat, it, it'll make a dinner unforgettable. Alright, hold on everyone, hold on. Let's go ahead and uh, expand this. Oh, I gotta pick it up first. And uh, uh, I think by the next video, I'll get 200. Uh, that'll, that'll be for next time. I See, I'm ready set for uh, 200. Yeah, we can now use the western half of the graveyard. I, I, I don't know why. Hello, buddy. Uh, Miss Charm sent me to do this. Ah, uh, she didn't tell you it was a joke? Uh, she used to be so sweet and naive. So, are you her new lover or what? Uh, uh I just met her. Oh, I already had her back and called typical. Oh, alright everyone, let's go ahead and do this before the next day. Okay, oh, oh it's, a, uh, it's a fire bat. Oh! What's it give me? Okay, that's a little disappointing. I thought I thought we were gonna face something new. Okay, the blue one's there, okay. This is a uh, floor six. There's a gold vein down here. It's only one time use though. Alright, alright, let's go ahead and uh, I won't do the next floor because I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. So I think uh between different videos I will uh, do some floors all the way until we get to level not level, but um the next um the next floor but I will have to try to make sure I go ahead and not this one this one go ahead and get this so oh with gem okay looks like I'm gonna have to do some gem oh okay I'm gonna take this all right so it says gem so oh I will get this too Oh wow, well, actually, by, by the time in the next video, there is a chance I might be able to unlock everything. So, when that happens, we will be in the end game. So, um, with that being said, uh, we're going to go ahead and meet up on the hill. Alright, alright, let's go, let's go, let's serve some food, everyone. Go, oh, oh. Do I talk to him? Look at the tent. Yummy, yummy food. Good, the people are going to love this. You probably earned a lot of money. Yes, Moshir. You, I, you know, at first I thought you were so kind of shady, like uh, you might be a problem. Oh, I, I'm still a problem. I, I have this strange feeling that you didn't belong here, but now it seems like you blended in just fine. You do what you've been asked to do, and profit means everything to you. Believe there is a place like you in the future of the world. The building we're going to, the world we're going to build in the town, the world, pure fate. Ha! One day, one day. The audience is gathering. Do your part well, and I, I'll do mine. What does that mean, do my part well? Oh, everything's ready for the next burning? Oh, oh, look, look, it's me, it's me. Oh, rest in peace, witch burning, oh boy, oh boy. Mm -hmm. This is yummy, yummy burgers, okay? There's nothing suspicious about the burgers. <laughs> Juicy burgers. They don't know what the ingredient. No one tells them. No one tells them. I'll take. Oh, I only made ten. This is the best burning I've ever been to. Oh, dinner and a show. Oh, not, but not for the witch though. Mmm, that's tasty. Smoky meat. Ha ha. That'd be pretty funny of our stall. Oh, four? The town will be talking for a month about the burning. Whenever you're ready, you should put on a repeat performance just to get your tent ready and we- Oh, you earned 33. Woo! Whoa! I can prove I'm loyal. I'm sure you can show that you trust the world enough to look after the hill. Indeed, perhaps one day I'll embrace you as an inquisitor apprentice. Meanwhile, I'll wait your reports. Oh. Okay, okay. Oh! 
They're, they're gone. Okay. It's all the local material, except for the silk and eh, for the benches. I bought that from my friend Merchant. Ah, oh, those merchants. Personally, I banished them from the kingdom. The whole lot of them. They're truly a dis distributors of sin, merchant, actor, doctors. The church already provides everything they offer, only holy and more righteousness. Alright, I've seen enough. I'll say this is church ready for a Wait, whoa. But you still need to make the dashi me. I don't know that should be. Oh, boy. I, I got so happy. Certainly. Alright, so that's going to be pushed off to later on. So with that, I will unlock marble then. I will unlock marble and then we're going to go ahead. All that stone will be turned into marble. Um, the statue wise, we can get different statues for that, right? Yeah, so there's three different kinds. I am going to vary on them. Oh, there are four different kinds. I am going to go ahead and vary on them because I don't want it all the same. Like it's, cause it it, it kind of looks ugly, right? It kind of looks ugly, but I will use all marble with different headstones only. We're going to go ahead and end off very soon. So with that being said, um, in the next video stuff, we're going to continue off with the main story. Maybe depending on if we complete like the bishop or the uh, inquisitor, we're going to go ahead and push towards the tavern. So I was going to build it, but I was like, uh, I'll wait till next time. We're going to go ahead and do that. Um, depending on how it goes, I might, I'll let you know if the steps that I mentioned before on the embalming will work on me. So I'm going to go ahead and try the steps I mentioned before and see if it works out. I don't know what, to, wait, well, I can bury them. Depending on marble, let's see how much um, those uh, uh, defenses, the headstone will give. Depending on how much it gave. If it gets 10, we're going to aim for 10. Right now, we're, I'm aiming for like 6 and 7. Because 6 and 7 is the one for polished stone. So I'm fine with that. So with that being said, that's the plan for next go. Is to finish off the main story and start with the DLC. And see how it goes. And see when I unlock the death stuff. And you probably tell here, I did go ahead and unlock the better better fertilizer so all right everyone uh looks like horace has a, a message for us oh whoa okay she's supposed to be that was kind of strange all right let's see what she says Croissant. you again uh tell me about snake 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 is just a joke oh thank you Tom, tell him to get back my money real money this time real money and if he can't find my mother's necklace then deal is off okay what necklace is that it's only one left of my mom she told me to keep it she told me that this necklace will make me feel and find love i sold it to pay for the chance to sing before the night now i'll glad buy it back but i can't find it snake everyone knows he can find anything in town so i paid him and he took my money and now i have no money and no necklace you're a strong intelligent man i'm sure you can find a way to have a poor woman all right, all right. I heard about the last witch burning. Sounds like an, it was quite an event. I think it's absolutely barbaric, but who am I to judge? I agree to you, buddy. In old days, our people arranged fight to the death just for entertainment. I don't support the burning. For me, it's just a way to sell beer. People even told me that you serve beer better than I do here, but I don't believe them. It's actually pretty good. I can bring you some. Oh. Okay, okay, I'll let I'll bring some for next time. All right, everyone. So with that being said, that marked it there. Join me next time. We're gonna go ahead and continue off of everyone's every every base game storyline for now. For now, which is the brown dot. We're gonna go ahead and do those for now, and then we'll see what happens then. So with that being said, have an awesome day, and I'll catch you later. Bye bye.